So XRP has been surging lately. There's been over a billion dollars a day in volume, and this is great. This is what's obviously helping hold up the price of XRP right now. It's not necessarily pulling back with the rest of the market. Yes, today, you know, it's down 2.22%, you know, at least at the time of making this video, but we're starting to see a little bit, bit of an upward trend playing out here. <clears throat> and so we're starting to see price predictions, especially as this Ripple SEC case draws closer to its conclusion. And that's fair, okay, because there's... Uh, there's something I want to talk to you guys about in this in this video, and I think that it's uh, it's super important. Now, some of these price predictions that we're seeing are, are all over the board, but <clears throat> you know most of them seem to be following this bullish trend line that we're getting. Okay, we've seen predictions up to about you know 51 cents by the end of November, and you know we're talking here. You know we're seeing 52, 55, 61. All these things are, are great and good, right? There's definitely a chance that that this could happen, especially with some of the macroeconomic easing that we're getting. And, you know, the, basically this GDP report that we just got, which showed, you know, I think 2.6% growth compared to the prior two quarters, the prior two quarters, which were both declines. This is obviously really good news. And it may play some impact on what they decide to do with, you know, inflation or uh, uh, interest rate hikes and stuff like that. But we'll obviously see how that plays out. But <clears throat> the biggest thing that will, Im you know, impact the price here is going to be that court case, right? That's that's what we've all been waiting on. That's what all XRP holders are waiting on. That's what I think most of crypto is waiting on right now. And there's huge price predictions coming out after that. <clears throat> so, for example, excuse me, guys, I got a little bit of a cold. <laughs> after the court case is resolved, there's a good chance that the price of XRP will rise to its all-time high of $3.40. So this is obviously big, right? Because we're looking at XRP sitting at number six right now, and it's at $23 billion. And that would actually push it all the way up to the number two coin. But I I think uh I don't think this is gonna happen. Okay. Not not that the you know price or the the market cap are gonna get up to this level. I don't think it's gonna hit the number two coin. And I want to talk to you guys about why. <clears throat> The catalyst, okay? The market is looking for a catalyst. And it I think that this court case playing out is going to be that for the market. Okay. And this is this is why I think this is important. The market has been looking for something to grasp onto. And this would just further reaffirm that cryptos are not crypto, you know, currency is not a security across the board. And what you're going to see then. And this is just my prediction. What I think you're going to see is XRP is actually going to drag the rest of the market with it. You're going to see a huge pump across the entire market. It may even be the catalyst for the next bull market cycle. Now, I don't know that this is going to happen, you know, exactly. I don't know it's going to happen at all, right? This is never financial advice. But this may be the catalyst that the market has been waiting for. You know, typically we need something to, to get things going, to trigger the bull market, to really start things pumping. And I think this could be a further, you know, affirmation that, or further confirmation that, that crypto is here to stay and going to do well. I mean, we all know this is going to be the case because of how, you know, how much it's getting integrated into our daily lives and, you know, big businesses buying crypto and there's crypto spending and all these sorts of things. But this may be the trigger, right? This may send things going. And if this market starts pumping, I'm guessing that'll do a lot of things for the other markets, right? It'll help improve the economy. We'll start to see the stock market going, all these sorts of things. And it may be driven by crypto, which would obviously be very, very cool. But that's all I really got for you guys in this video. I'm really, really hopeful and excited for the future and what is to come. And I think we'll probably know more over these next few months. But as always, this is never financial advice. I do this just for informative and entertainment purposes. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you haven't already, make sure you show your support for the channel. Hit that subscribe button. Hit that little bell. And that way you can stay updated anytime there's new content live here on the channel. Hope you guys have a wonderful day. And I hope to catch you in the next one. Take care, guys.